and later TV sets. That's why E.I. signed in 1959 the first and in 1966 the second contract about the license transfer from the Netherlands company Philips. The license transfer contract included the electron tubes of Novel, Magnol and Deckel series. The license was completely mastered and our factory possesses the master technology for the production of 131 types of electron tubes. The maximum capacity of approximately 12 million pieces was achieved in 1977. Semiconductors removed the electron tubes from the first insertion and our factory continued to manufacture the tubes mainly for the servicing requirements in our country and abroad. The biggest customers were Philips, Siemens, Telefunken and others. And these companies even wanted us to label our products with their trademarks, which is a sufficient proof of our tube's quality and we are proud of that. Our factory is within the system of electronic industry niche. It works with full liability and it employs 480 workers of different professions and levels of qualification. The work is organized in two shifts. The organization of our factory is conceived in such a way that all functions necessary for normal work of an independent enterprise exist in the factory. The work is organized through the production department, which includes also electric and mechanical maintenance. The financial commercial department includes the economic accounting division, which deals with supply, sales and marketing, and the division for planning and automatic data process. The technical department includes the development division, technical preparation of production and administrative division. The factory is managed by a general director who has three assistants for production, economic, financial and technical departments. We pay special attention to the development. 27 engineers and technicians are employed. The renowned world manufacturers of electron tubes stopped their production many years ago. We have stayed in this field just because of the servicing requirements in our country and abroad, and thanks only to the quality of our products. New designs of audio equipment, primary amplifiers in the USA, required new types of electron tubes. Some of the designers and the manufacturers of this equipment have visited us and have got acquainted with our production possibilities and they've expressed their great interest in our production of power tubes which are used in audio devices. On the basis of their interest, we had developed the tubes which were tested by our American customers and which are currently included in our production program. EL34, 6L6GC, KT90, 6FQ7, ECC81, ECC82, ECC83, ECC88, and we are now developing the tubes 6JE6, 6LF6, and 6KD6. These facts guarantee that our factory has got a known position in the production of electron tubes and that vacuum technique has not achieved the, vacuum, the maximum of its possibilities yet. Beside the electron tubes, we also produce microfilm equipment, cameras for documentation filming on microfilms or microfishes, developers, duplicators and a few types of microfilm or microfish readers with manual or automatic searching. Our production program includes also the mounting of microwave ovens which are applied to households. The technology of high-frequency metal glass joint was developed for the requirements of X-ray tubes factory, image intensifiers factory and semiconductors factory. The joints are made for high vacuum products and the tolerances are very strict. For the requirement of the pharmaceutical industry, we produce small bottles for packing of certain types of tablets. We use glass tubes for the production of these bottles. The quality of the glass is the first hydrolytic group. For the requirements of cables factory from Sertozarevo, we have developed several types of metal glass connectors. Our connectors are extremely reliable and they have been attested 
for the application in special purpose products. Our factory has been exporting its products to the West Europe market for many years and we have been present on the American market since 1988. The value of our export in 1990 was $2,600,000, which included more than 90% of total production of electric tubes. In order to operate, the electron tube must be degassed at a vacuum of 10 to minus 4 tors, which is achieved. We achieve the vacuum on special carousels, which are equipped with pre-vacuum oil and diffusion mercury pumps, which is preceded by sealing of a pressteller with a bulb. During the degassing of the tube, the degassing and activation of cathode are performed. For the high voltage tubes, we use potting and soldering by which we mount metal caps which lead high voltage. In order to get the tubes with required characteristics, we perform the cathode forming on special forming frames where specific voltages are applied in very tight tolerances and in the specific order. All produced tubes are 100% controlled during the process. We make measurements of several specific parameters which are essential for the normal operation and tube exploitation in devices. We pay special attention to the checking of measuring instruments and we control them regularly. The average rejects percentage is about 8% and we are satisfied with the fact that in such a complicated and complex technology we keep that percentage.
The measured tubes are labeled with the marks of EI and the tube type. After labeling, we do the packing which can be group, industrial or individual, according to the customer's requirement. By the sampling method, according to the specific AQL, we take the samples from each production or batch for the quality tests which we make in our laboratory, which is specially equipped for such tests. The tests are extremely strict and according to the strictly determined limits and parameters and only after the verification of our quality laboratory, the packed electron tubes to the finished product's storehouse go to our customers. Thanks to the quality of its products, the factory has acquired the high reputation among the customers worldwide and we shall do our best to preserve that reputation in future.